Fall Night Chapter 4 Season 3 is not far away, and we have confirmed map changes for Chapter 4 Season 3, a brand new leaked trailer, and also Battle Pass skins for Chapter 4 Season 3. So make sure you do not go anywhere as you do not want to miss out on any of this information. I am still gifting on the channel if you would like a gift from me in the Fall Night item shop, all you need to do is drop a like on this video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on the post notification bell. And if you would like to support the channel furthermore, you can in the item shop by using code HRFN. And using my code does mean we can do more gifting and giveaways on the channel. But starting off first, thanks to leakers, we have our very first look at leaked weapons for Chapter 4 Season 3. Firstly, helicopters will be returning and will have a brand new launcher. I will be able to shoot every two seconds. A brand new leather pistol will also be releasing into the game as well. That is pretty cool. A thermal bolt action sniper will also be releasing into the game as well. And lastly, a mythic drum shotgun. Let me know in the comment section down below if you are excited for any of these weapons to release. Secondly, if you didn't know, leakers actually leaked the key art for Chapter 4 Season 3. And as you can see, here are the leaked skins for Chapter 4 Season 3's Battle Pass. Starting off first, as you can see, here is an Optimus Prime skin that will be releasing into the game. That looks really, really cool in my opinion. And this skin will most likely have a built-in emote, most likely being the Optimus Prime skin turning into his robot form. And this skin is confirmed to be releasing into the Chapter 4 Season 3 Battle Pass. And here is most likely what this skin will look like inside of the Battle Pass. And then in the back, you can see a Summer Meow School skin that will also be releasing into the Battle Pass as well. And this skin will also have other styles you will be able to choose from, kind of working like the Tuna Fish skin. And then in the front, you can see a skin that will be the Tier 1 skin for Chapter 4 Season 3. That is also really, really cool in my opinion. And here is also another version of this skin, most likely being the max version of this skin that you will be able to unlock when you do level up through the battle pass. And then to the right, you can also see a mechanic skin that will also be releasing into the game as well. That does look really, really cool in my opinion. And as you can see, this skin is sitting on a raptor that will be rideable in Chapter 4 Season 3. And when these raptors do release into the game, we are also expecting flyable animals as well that will also be rideable. And the reason we do know this is leakers have leaked this for a little while now. Spider-Man 2 gameplay was also revealed the other day and has had lots of people speculating about this version of Venom that could actually be releasing into the game as well. And the reason we do know this is we have seen lots of Marvel skins released into the item shop before. And this Venom skin could be releasing inside of the Battle Pass as the secret skin or in the item shop in Chapter 4 Season 3. And let me know in the comment section down below if you would buy this skin if it was to release into the game. Another collab that could be happening next season that leakers have found out currently being worked on by Epic Games. And as you can see, it does say Epic Games are currently moving their staff over to bigger projects. And as you can see, one of these projects do say Fortnite X Lego. And this collab could be happening as of next season. That would be absolutely amazing if it was to happen. And when this collab does take place, hopefully Epic also allow players to buy different Lego skins inside of the item shop. Another skin looking very likely to be releasing into Chapter 4 Season 3 is the brand new Agent Jonesy skin. Of course, Agent Jonesy hasn't been seen in the Fortnite storyline for a little while, but it finally looks like he will be returning with this brand new skin. And this skin's confirmed name is the Legend skin, who is Agent Jonesy, becoming the seventh member of the Seven. And the reason we do know that this skin is going to be called the Legend skin is because the Imagined Order did die inside of the Marvel Zero War comic. And of course, Agent Jonesy has been helping the Seven for quite a few seasons now, and it only makes sense that so we are going to be seeing this brand new skin release. There are also two styles of this brand new legend skin and as you can see this legend skin does look amazing And as you can see with this skin you will be able to take off the armor pieces of this skin Kind of like the origin skin and in my opinion I'm really really excited for this brand new skin to release A vehicle also looking very likely to still be releasing into the brand new Fortnite season is the brand new jet skis This is because a Fortnite concept artist by the name of Drew Hill has added artwork for a brand new battle jet ski not too long ago. And to make this even more likely to be releasing, Blue Hill's artwork has been used in the game before. And as you can see on the back of this jet ski, you can see a rocket engine. Meaning when these jet skis do release, you will be able to boost like the boats that we have seen in the game before. A brand new gameplay feature that will also be releasing is the first person game mode. Of course, the first
first person game mode was expected to be releasing but of course we are yet to see this first person game mode release luckily we do know that epic games are still experimenting with this first person game mode this is because leakers have said that the first person game mode has been updated quite a few times in the in-game files tim sweeney also said himself that epic games are still experimenting with this first person game mode and are trying to release this first person game mode into the not too distant future and of course epic games do know that the first person game mode will bring back lots of the og players to fortnite and are definitely trying their hardest to get this first person game mode ready for next season and let me know in the comment section down below if you are excited for this first person game mode to release weapon charms are also looking very likely to be releasing with this first person game mode and in my opinion weapon charms would look amazing on your weapon in the first person game mode and when these weapon charms do release hopefully epic do allow players to unlock different weapon charms inside of the item shop and hopefully epic also allow players to unlock different weapon charms for either events or challenges that will take place later on in this fortnite season and let me know in the comment section down below if you are excited for these weapon charms to release weapon attachments are also another feature we could be seeing released into chapter 4 season 3 and here is a look on screen showing you guys exactly what these weapon attachments would look like if they was to release into the game and the reason we do know that these weapon attachments are going to be releasing is because leakers have said that weapon attachments have been updated after two years and you will be able to add support for these attachments and also modify the weapon recoil the wall running feature is also still looking very likely to be releasing into the brand new fortnite season and in my opinion if this wall running feature was going to be releasing this would be groundbreaking and luckily at the moment we do have information about this wall running feature and the information we do have is to be able to wall run you will have to jump onto the wall and also the distance you do travel on the wall also depends on the speed you did get before wall running another reason why this could be releasing is because we haven't seen a feature release into fortnite for a little while as of course in chapter 2 season 1 we did get to see the swimming feature and in chapter 3 we also saw the sliding ability as well but that is about today's video and if you did enjoy this video make sure to drop a like on this video and subscribe to the channel with the post notification bell turned on and don't forget to watch the next video that does pop up on screen after this video so you do not want to miss out on that but thank you ever so much for watching this video onto the channel and i'll catch you guys in the next one thanks for watching Optimus, you must see why i had to betray you you didn't betray me you betrayed yourself. No!